One of the things that I've learned from doing playback theater is that everybody has wonderful stories, meaningful stories, but not everybody is given an opportunity to tell them or an invitation. We need an invitation sometimes. Playback theater is all about creating the right setting for these stories that otherwise might not be shared. Playback theater offers audience members an opportunity to share stories from their own lives that have any kind of feeling connected to them. So we can accommodate stories of deep grief and sadness and anger and happiness. And that's what the form allows to have happen in the room instead of just a scripted performance. What is the best part of performing playback? Well, for one thing, uh, the performance is new every night, every time. Uh, there's, a, there's a structure that holds this and that, that, that hopefully remains the same from performance to performance. But the content of the performance is being revealed to us as performers at the same time that's being revealed to the audience. That's very exciting. The other thing is that um, playback is very flexible and so we will have, we will maybe have one evening of stories about people's pets and another evening we'll hear three stories about people who were in the World Trade Center when it was attacked. Playback is different from other kinds of theater because it's interactive it requires a safe atmosphere, and it's an opportunity for everyone in the room to have empathy with everyone else.